Welcome to this Glaucos edition of the uh, Inject W uh, Microstent. I wanted to uh, highlight a couple features that I find really useful. The first one, we must relax, clear the mind. I find uh, the yoga technique of taking a deep breath in, hold, and a long, slow breath out really helps slow the heart rate. Remember, we're trying to hit a 125 micron target here. So I have a beautiful on false view, well-defined TM, and look at the skull spur there. I'm going with the trocar just over the spur, small indent, and punch. Here's a nice uh, high resolution view and you can see I've highlighted the uh, scleral spur. Notice how the flange of the inject is actually uh, below the, the scleral spur. Uh, it's posterior. There's nice proof of concept. We hit that perfectly. I really believe this is the better location for the stent. Between stents I move the scope. Everything has to change. My seat, my scope, I angle it differently. I want to get another perfect on false view. And here we go. I've got the lens on. And I'm working to get um, just the right angle on uh, the approach. Again, beautiful highlighted uh, TM with pigment. Uh, scleral spurs, very well visualized. And uh, there's something interesting there. Take a look at that little shadow up there, that red shadow. And that is a perforating vein. So I'm going to try and put this stent right below that perforating vein. And there it is. Get it in. Give it a little tap just to make sure it's seated properly. And take a look at this. Uh, I'm going to go out and uh, come back in with my IA. And what we'll see is there it is. Both of them are uh, doing a really nice job with some reflux. I like to clear out the viscoelastic right over the device first. I really don't want to push viscoelastic into the device in the canal. I like to clear it out. And here, uh, clearing out the rest of it. Both stents are uh, looking really great. Then I bring the eye back to neutral, and there's our perforating vein right there. You can see how it's doing a beautiful job of refluxing back into the eye. And on the other side of the eye is just a regular scleral vein. And in a minute, I'm going to show you uh, proof of this. That one's a perforator and one is a scleral. So that's a lot of reflux. I'm going to go in and clear some of that out and pressurize the eye. And watch what happens to the perforating vein here. It's gone yeah, because mostly it's being filled with BSS now. Whereas the scleral vein on the other side is still still there. It's draining a, a different system. And when I take it out, look at that, it fills right back up. Um, there was another vein there next to the scleral vein that came back as well. So we had, we've got some really great flow from these two devices, and uh, I expect excellent performance out of this uh, this implantation. So that's my uh, my major tips for uh, implanting the Inject W. Um, thank you very much for your attention.